Good morning. Welcome to a new episode of Draw My Life. Today, we are doing a video for Grammy winning singer songwriter Billie Eilish. We hope you enjoy today's video. The characters in this clip were not shown for the purposes to duplicate the star's resemblance. We will be making our own animations with some graphic effects to portray the story of Billie. Disclaimer, everything you are about to see in this video is non-fictional. The characters and their plot twist are real. Join us as we take you through her life and career. Without further ado, let's get started. So Billie Eilish pirate Baird O'Connell was born in Los Angeles, California. The singer grew up in a disorganized house surrounded by musical instruments and baby pictures, which might have been the perfect place to create songs in the first place. Her parents were artists themselves, and they named her Billie Eilish pirate Baird O'Connell, and she was born on December 18, 2001. Eilish grew up in a household of actors and musicians and was homeschooled along with her brother Phineas O'Connell, the Slightlies. And her favorite color is black. At the age of eight, she joined the Los Angeles Children's Choir, developing the soulful vocals that would later appear on her early singles. Eilish has spent her entire life singing, dancing, and writing music. She was 13 when she jump-started her music career by uploading Ocean Eyes, a soul-stirring track produced by Phineas O'Connell, her older brother, onto SoundCloud. In 2015, Billie made a debut into the music industry as she uploaded her track on SoundCloud. Little did Billie know that within a couple of hours, Ocean Eyes caught eyes and ears from various websites and Billie has been on an upswing ever since. The song made her an overnight singing sensation. Eilish signed with Vivendi Essays Vivhi 1.35% Interscope Records 2 one half years ago, the label has been developing her streaming success across a collection of early songs part of what executives say is a strategy to build a career versus a one-hit wonder. After some time consulting for Republic Records, Lubliner met Interscope CEO John Janik, who offered Darkroom a subsidiary deal. He first heard Billie Eilish sing in 2015 when she uploaded Ocean Eyes to SoundCloud and immediately set off to find her, later signing her to Interscope. It says she inked a deal with Universal Music Corp. According to the contract, the advance is for a minimum of five new songs. According to the deal, Billie gets $1.5 million within days of the time the deal is signed. And the rest was history. Billie Eilish has produced a confident addition to the Bond tradition and has proved that she can step outside of her comfort zone, paving the way for other young artists to preserve and rework older music traditions. On Sunday night, January 26, Billie did in fact become the second artist in Grammy history to win all four of the big four categories, Best New Artist, Album of the Year, for full-length debut When We All Fall Asleep, Where Do We Go, Song of the Year and Record of the Year, both for Bad Guy. The singer said that she's also struggled with body dysmorphia and depression throughout her life. After starting dance classes at age 12, Eilish realized she suffered from body image issues. She has over 45 million monthly listeners on Spotify and collaborated with many other wildly successful artists, like Justin Bieber and Khalid. At only 18 years old, Eilish is already one of the most successful women in the music industry. The 18-year-old closed the year with a reported 2.5 million total album equivalents sold, putting her at 400,000 more units ahead of runners-up Ariana's Thank You Next and Taylor Swift's Lover, both of which sold roughly 2.1 million units in 2019. Tell us your thoughts in the comments. What is your favorite Billie Eilish song and why? 